invite uh, Mr. Damidu Lirara Chief to share your experiences with us. Okay. Okay. So, um, wish you all a very good afternoon. Uh, my name is, I think it'll be better if I introduce myself. Uh, my name is Damidu Lianara Chi, and I'm, I'm a final year student here in Goma State Medical University, and uh, I'm the president of uh, Sri Lankan Students Association in uh, Gomel. Uh, first of all, I would like to thank Dr. Lasanta and the Russian Educational Center for giving me this opportunity to speak a few words uh, on behalf of uh, our university. Um, well, I thought of uh, speaking to you in two aspects, the, the student life and also the academic aspects. Um, I think it'll, it'll be better if we start with the academic aspects because uh, that is why people are um, trying to get into this university. And I think I'm pretty sure that most of you have uh, sort of searched and done your research uh, prior to this webinar. So I'll be adding a few things uh, which I have uh, personally experienced. Um, it's actually... Uh, um, if we start from the um, very basic uh, things, um, usually it's a six-year degree program. So for the first three years, um, we will be uh, studying the theory-based uh, subjects. And from fourth year onwards, you guys will have the clinical exposure and uh, the practical know-how about the stuff which you have learned uh, for your you know, previous uh, three years. And um, the curriculum is being carried out in English medium completely. And uh, apart from uh, that, usually you will have subjects like uh, Russian language subjects so that, you know, you'll be much more exposed and you'll get a proper exposure of the language so that you, you can uh, sort of, uh, you know, get into the system here. And um, afterwards, uh, as uh, uh, Ajit Ankal mentioned before, you can do your internship here, which is also recognized in uh, many countries. Um, and uh, uh, speaking of uh, the academic support, which the university support, uh, supplies us, they will supply us with the books and everything. You'll have a library, uh, which um, will supply you all the clinical, specifically the international books, uh, international curriculum, which you need to know uh, as you go along your pathway in medicine. And uh, the teachers here are very friendly. They will uh, support you any way possible. And um, also your peer groups, you'll be divided into groups once you come here, maximum maybe 10 students, 10 to 12 students in one group, and you will be paid uh, in individual attention. Um, I apologize for any noise which has been heard because I'm in front of the hospital right now. Um, and you'll be paid the individual attention and everything and uh, the, the clinical exposure and everything. Um, the staff is uh, actually very capable doctors. Uh, most of them are professors uh, in their own uh, subjects and you can get the maximum benefit out of it. Um, I think uh, that is one of the main reasons why you should choose uh, Gomez State Medical University if you, are, uh, if you want to give value to the money that you are about to spend. Um, so that is basically about uh, the academic uh, uh, scenario here in Gomel State Medical University. So I'll just um, discuss a few things about uh, the student life and everything. So once you come here, um, you will be taken care of by the seniors. Uh, you will be uh, supported each and every way possible. You'll be uh, administered to the hostels here. In uh, We actually have three hostels here. So uh, I think there's a fourth hostel which is about to be added because a lot of students are coming to Gomel now. Um, so, uh, once you come here, uh, the transportation and everything will be supplied from Minsk to Gomel. So, because I know this, because uh, the man Sergey will be there to welcome you at the airport and, um, uh, your lunch, dinner and everything, uh, will be supplied for the first couple of days until you get, uh, used to the situation here. Um, and, uh, we will be supporting you with, uh, you know, buying your winter clothes, winter shoes, uh, books and everything so we have a good set of seniors here i have a good board of uh, seniors here in my association so everyone will help you once you come here um so for each and every aspect we have uh, a particular uh, vice president appointed for example for education there's a vice president for sports for cultural events so those kind of things uh, there are specific vice presidents uh, under uh, under us in the association so all those things are well planned so I will give you a couple of uh, examples of uh, the student life here. So uh, in the past couple of months, actually the past semester, we had uh, 
uh, a various number of uh, new uh, additions to um, our general curriculum. For example, we organized a volleyball tournament. We organized a chess tournament. Uh, we organized a New Year celebration party. Uh, we organized the Christmas party. So, um, and the next semester onwards, also we have a number of things planned uh, because we know that uh, academics are not the only things which should be in a student's life. So we try to balance them as much as possible. I, I'm pretty sure you guys will enjoy once you come here. Um, and also, um, I think uh, for each and every uh, event which we organize here, the Russian Educational Center has funded us, has supported us in both monetary aspects and also in guidance as well. So I'm really thankful to them. Um, so uh, I guess that sort of sums up uh, the things which uh, you should know. So I think we have another couple of students uh, in this meeting, uh, a first year student who will explain you about the life uh, of first years uh, as juniors. And we also have another senior who will explain you certain aspects which I haven't. Um, so I hope that you choose Gomez State Medical University. Once you come here, everything will be taken care of and we will give you our full support. And uh, I would like to answer each, if uh, any of you have any questions. Um, you can contact me through my WhatsApp number or anything if you have any questions. And uh, hope to see you soon. And thank you very much.